in the bottom right corner we've got again on the Protoss Mr. Cheese and in the top left corner we've got Mr. Nuke on the Zerg again on the Protoss what else would he play? well different color yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know um, yeah I see Cheese is going for another cannon rush same as always Nuke better be prepared for it. Oh, wait. And he is what prepared. Is he <laughs> he, <laughs> Already he pulling is, his drones. <laughs> he's taking a hatchery here. And he's gonna send Lynx, I think. I think he's gonna be Lynx. Actually, uh, did you see maybe how, uh, the way uh, which he used to uh, get his probe there? I did he not see. To, uh, look at the map. He tried to avoid uh, meeting uh, Jesus' probe as much as possible, uh, just to make it unscouted. On That's really hand. smart. Yeah, I mean, not not really smart. It's just strategy, and that drone took a vacation. Wait, what's going on? Ah, he's building a pool. Oh, oh! And drones. Nice probe, that. Yeah, I don't, I, I don't have that special uh, <laughs> uh, casting uh, observer, observer thingy. Uh, me so either. I can do that. Uh, yeah, I'm okay. Maybe I can implement it in the stream. One sec. If I just add another scene. Wait, the hatchery is going up. And I think he should be getting the link soon, but I'm not sure. Uh, can I add yeah, text? that's link coming up. Links, links coming up. Uh, even though it's chasing the probe, uh, it's almost dead. Wow, this my right. Six links. Uh, that will be enough to deny everything. That's why she's getting an expansion. Is building his pile and on the low ground. Not sure how it will help him though. Is that a cannon? Yes, it, of, of course it's a cannon. You gotta get some defenses or you'll die. But he has no defenses on the high ground. Which means the pylon is basically uh, doomed. Meanwhile, he's getting a roach warrant. Probably to push it again, and the second hatchery is done. One sec, the Discord thing is in the way of the production tab. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm head to move it. Let me disable it. Honestly? Yes. Oh, oh okay. I missed that. Okay, uh, well, nuke one. That is 1-1. One, one. No, there was no way uh, Cheese could win from that point. Uh, can we edit that? WCS game hard. Let me edit the score. There we go. What do you think of my sexy scoreboard? I don't know. Uh, what scoreboard are you talking about? On my stream. Oh, uh, which one was changed, right? Uh. Where's your stream? Uh, here it is. Let me check. Wait, I will get the map and a link to the lobby. What of Xandro? All right. Give me a link. Darth, please, a link. Darth, give a link. There we go. Port Alexander. Observer and replay. 
and choose observer. Okay, uh, let me see. Options. Observer and replay. Observer interface. WCS 3.0. Wait, do I need to rejoin the lobby? Uh, no, you don't. Why would you? Well, Gabe says one chat. Uh, wait, let me rejoin. There we go. Uh, I'm ready. Ready when you are. I mean, I'm a caster after all, so it doesn't really matter. Oh, I'm going to both take here. Perfect. Three, two, one. Go, go, fight. By the way, your scoreboard is... Uh, Alright, introduction time. <laughs> We're playing on Port Alexander. Game number three. Number three. <laughs> She's actually changed color. <laughs> oh my god. That's cool, okay. Right, go ahead. In the top left corner, we've got Nuke on the blue Zerg, also color changed. And in the uh, bottom right corner, we've got the green Protoss for the cheese. And he looks like he's going for another. And yeah, rush is he? Yeah, okay. The only strat he knows. <laughs> uh, how do oh, I? Getting <laughs> gas. Who and another guess. So what's the score? The score is one one one. Uh, how, how do I do one, it? One. And how do I change for cheese? Change what? Uh, the score on the overlay. Nope. Uh, oh, control one. Thank you. There we go. Is it so loud? Time though. Oh, shit. One. Yeah, got it fixed. Uh, let let's remove oh, my score um, screen. There we go. Where is he building? Oh, he's there. Okay. Oh, Lord. Has it been spotted yet? I don't know, I don't know how to, all the hotkeys kind of work. I'm wondering what's going on, because double guess for Zerg is not uh, that of an opener. I think, I'm not sure though, I'm not an expert on StarCraft. <laughs> Join the club. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm almost platinum. Uh, I was uh, still a one uh, for like five days ago, now I'm gold one. Almost plat. Hmm. I think she's should be thinking by now uh, what the heck is going on because uh, Nuke doesn't really try to avoid getting kind of rushed uh, and more rushed and uh, letter D for production uh, G for upgrades uh, and for a APM Okay, looks like Nuke is already building his first Ravager. Oh, wait, um, I did something. Did what? Oh, no, never mind. Ne never mind, it's, it's fixed. Oh, yeah, land corrosive bios, land corrosive bios. 
but yeah, he actually managed to hold it off, and I think now uh, Nuke is winning. Because Stalker is not a great defense against three Ravagers and Roach, four Ravagers rather, and there's gonna be more Ravagers and Roaches. Shield battery, I think it won't be enough since it simply won't finish on time. First stalk we got out. It doesn't matter. Nah. No shield battery. Mm -hmm. Yep. Shield yeah. battery. There goes the cannon. And he cancelled it just in time. But he has another shield cannon up here. Let's see how it's going on here. Nothing much, okay. Uh, Cheese is building a robotics facility down the cliff. If that's so safe, I don't know, because he's getting wrecked up over there. I think this will be a fast concede for Cheese. Uh, yeah, I also think so, because robotics facility doesn't really help against Ravagers, because no. again, uh, they're not armored and the models don't deal any extra damage to them. Plus he does death power for it. And the probe just got taken down. Oh yeah. And he does oh, nothing robotics. in his main. Robotics facility is... What the fuck? Yeah, there we go. Oh, what that did he say? A... BG yeah, from cheese. Yeah, is that toxicity? A... That stands for a bad game. Uh, yeah. I think it's kind of... Unpolitely to say that to your opponent. But... <laughs> um... <laughs> I, I pressed on return to game. How do I quit the game now? F10. Uh, F10. 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 Thank, uh, thank you. Uh, yeah. Escape didn't work. <laughs> I'm so good at this game. <laughs> <laughs> so now it's two to one for enough, Nuke. If you look at the score summary tab uh, in the game results, it will be uh, basically the same. Uh, 7,175. Which is surprising enough, I think. Race gone. Year zero. Well, oh, you didn't get invited. Oh. <laughs> I didn't get invited. Now waiting for birthday, and then we can go. I'm already. He is, yes, he just turned. Okay. Oh, cheese didn't even say something. Okay. <laughs> oh, and cheese is the host. Ah. What did you say again? Nah, leave it. Alright. That's the same. Nuke change color once again. I think it's uh, a part of uh, his strategy and cheaters as well. They're trying to confuse uh, their opponents <laughs> uh, with changing colors. You've turned your opponent. On this map, uh, uh, since it's basically red, it is, as you can see, uh, in the center, in the top center, there's Eamon's head. And there's a lot of red on this map. So with the red color, uh, nukes, for instance, overloads might be less noticeable. In fact, there will be. Well, if cheese had chosen purple, that would have been a great camouflage as well. But it would be just really hard to see. Wait, what's going on? Someone joined. And in the top right corner, we've got the green Protoss, Mr. Cheese boy and then in the top left corner we've got the red zerk mr nuke she's just sending already a probe to his main base but is he okay. gonna can rush oh yeah go I ahead i noticed uh, that aemon was there on this map for some reason wait aemon's on, on this map yeah in the top oh what center. the fuck yeah <laughs> okay I, I did not know that Okay, Just today I learned. Myself. 
So yeah, let's just take a look at the production tab. And there's a pool coming up. Obviously, at twelve pool for nuke control. Uh, oh update. wait, I need to edit this. Nuke has two. Jesus one. Okay, let's see. Uh, what is Cheese doing right here? He's building he three gateways, yeah. three proxy oh. gateways. That's new. That's new. That's a zealot all in. I think it might get scouted. Nuke has his first army already. Oh, yeah, got the best of five. Okay. Nuke is already pushing towards the main base of Cheese, which is a really smart move since Cheese has nothing yeah. to defend himself. He There's a queen, and so if he gets enough drones. Wait, did Nuke scout this? No, he did not. Ah, he's he did gonna not scout yet. it. Is he? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. He's gonna retreat the Zerklings as soon as possible. Where Cybernetics is coming up. Yeah. There's a queen, a zerglins, and an expansion. There come the first two zealots. And Nuke doesn't even bother by using... Okay, I guess. There you go. He is hunting down the probes. If Nuke wins, we get to see the bronze match. The bronze league heroes! <laughs> Nuke is setting up... Four spine crawlers already in spawn or in spawn in uh in his main base. How many workers do they have? Yeah, th this is GG. Against zero Cheese no, economy one. is messed up. He only has four zealots and one probe at his proxy base. Yeah. Well, GG. Not even a GG. Toxic. <laughs> oh, yeah, toxic. Area. Well, there was that. Um, Nuke official won the match. Congratulations. Now I'm up against Bofty. Oh, you're playing? Ah, yeah. oh, that's good. Uh. GG. Um, in two minutes, we've got Lurch versus Bofty. Good, okay, I've got a gape on my side. <laughs> oh, hey, I'm playing. Haha. <laughs> Uh, let me check. Yeah, it's Lurch versus Bufti. If this page will refresh, then we can get the scores in. Lurch, why don't you join? Okay, there we are. Is it Gabe here? Well, he, he does have to start it anyway, so we'll see. Uh, 
Uh, if anyone wants to see the brackets, I'll post them in chat. There we go. Oh, well, it uh, looks like I'm the only one casting this match then. <laughs> Although I know the least of this game. <laughs> Alright. Eight viewers, that's really nice. The highest of this evening. Um, if I remember correctly, this is the best out of three. So we'll set it up nine. Playing on Cyber Forest, the the fourth and third place matches. Sadly, I was the first to fall, but that does not matter because I suck anyways. Okay, in the bottom right corner, we've got. Lurch, the blue protos, or the bottom right, did I say bottom right? I don't know. And in the top left, we have the Red Terran, both the Frenchmen. So this is Bronze League Heroes, kinda like, yeah, okay. Uh, Control Shift 3, there we go, best of 3. The shiny loco icon. Not even a plebs icon, twat. Here we have his own. Uh, looks like Buffy is already supply dropped. Uh, or supply blocked, rather. Uh, let's see what is Lord's gonna do. Is he gonna go for the main base? He must be. Or he's gonna proxy. One of those. Uh, looks like he's building a gateway. So that's not a cannon rush, he's just gonna scout. Another gateway. Double gateway with two gas. Can Lurch get in on time? Yes he can. Slow buffy, probably because he drank wine again. I don't mind it. Buffy's not gonna really do anything else. Wait, is he gonna bail the second expansion? Is he? can't be. Yeah, he is. There we go. The fast expo from both the and it's just his natural. And he's gonna train Reapers. Reapers. That's gonna get us uh, exciting. There's no special passageway. Is there? No, wait, maybe this is special passageway. I don't know. Lurch, not any forces yet, and he's instantly researching warp gate, which allows him to teleport his troops onto the battlefield instantly. Bufti not even attacking with his reaper yet. He did kill the, do you call it? He did kill the probe from Lurch. That's good for him. The robotics facility. And he's building adepts. Okay, building adepts. He's probably gonna rush into his main base. But he can't yet. Because it's blocked off. So he'll just destroy one of the depots. Boofty warming up his APM. Can we see the APM? No, we can't. Oh, wait. Uh, okay, I guess. Building a second. No activity in the robotics bay yet. Warpgate still researching. And meanwhile, there's a battle being fought over here. Both to retreating everything he has. Ah, oh, shame. He can't attack air. That's unfortunate. 
If Lutz is smart, he just goes and blocks it. But he's not smart. Warpgate almost finishing up. And he's building a robotics bay. What is he gonna build? Probably disruptors. I'd love to see disruptors. They're so satisfying if you're good with them. Warp gates finished. Getting two warp gates already. Took its damn time. Oh no, lurch your troops. Lurch. No. And he just got out with one adept. That's fine. That's not too bad. We can live with that. Finishing up his expansion with one stalker and one immortal already. That's a quick immortal. Oh wait, no, it's actually four minutes in already. See, I don't know anything about Starcraft. That's why I'm a bronze 2 pleb. I'm the worst in the entire clan. Bog, okay. Bufti buffing up his entire production with three mules. Researching the steam packs and building up his army, marines. And Marauders. Building a factory. Which is probably gonna build siege tanks. Because he's just building a standard turn build up. Uh, looks like Buffy already has his uh, plus one attack. And now he's researching his plus one armor. On the other end. Lurch doesn't even have a single force yet. Why don't you have a forge yet? Up upgrade your units, man. Oh, he is probably gonna get Blink. Is he gonna get Blink? No, he's gonna get Colossus. He has... He already has one. Okay. Well, it's just going for straight up big army, but there he... There comes the fight. Here comes the fight. Or not. This looks like a fight... Bufti will win because of the Marauders. But keep in mind, Lurch has two really big tanks. But our Marauders can easily take care of that. Or not. Lurch is actually winning this fight. That's really nice. There we go, Lurch won this fight. Good boy. Marauders are actually less powered than I thought. Bufti almost finishing up his plus one armor. And there is he. Lurch building his Templar archives and more gateways. More gateways, okay. Finishing up his charge and turmoil lens is starting up. But why is he building or researching charge if he has zero zealots? I don't get it. I never will. But hey, they're doing it. Uh, yeah, 10 seconds for the plus one armor, and he's building Vikings, he's building Vikings. Starport with double, with a reactor, building a tech lab on his factory and finishing up its third command center, probably gonna go over here. That's what I will do. Has, having a bunker here for defense, to defend a attack from... Mr. Lord, having his third, fourth, and fifth, sixth warp gate finished up. He's building two forts right now, really good, so that he can get up the upgrading as well. He's making disruptors now. I expected them him to do that earlier, but yeah, it's there. Researching the storm, it's probably gonna blow some. Heavy wreckage on them. Storm versus Marines is rather good. Surprise, surprise. Light units versus big area damage. Yes. Having more mules dropped. He's just gonna build more Vikings. Yeah, there you go. Just a standard uh, Terran build up. Building an observer, but not having the research for the observer yet. Building Archons. Why are you researching this if you build Ar uh, I should not speak about that because I just suck dick at StarCraft. Yes. Building three more gateways. And Bufti is preparing to move out. Uh, building 
another Colossus and getting the plus two attack. Getting its first siege tank, but can it go into siege already? I don't think so. Psionic Storm finishing up. APM rather low on the side of both two. But hey, this is Bronze League Heroes after all. What is he doing? He is getting plus one, plus one. No shields. And he's both, he's chronoing them both. Okay, that's good for him. Good for him. Good, good, good. What is he doing? Oh, that's Observer. He just spotted he has no turret here yet, but he does not know about this. He does not see this. He expects him to go via here. Is he gonna check now? Yes, he is. He's gonna discover his third and potentially his fourth as well. Both the having no... The Colossi goes to his death. Oh no, what is he doing? What the fuck? Fuck. <laughs> Why is he doing this? Does he just not want him anymore? How do we go to supply? Nah, it's not supply. Oh, no, wait, no, that's not what I want. How do I go to supply tab? Oh wait, no, never mind. It's right there. Okay, buff T is supply blocked. Lurch has more than enough. Uh, let's see what they're doing. <laughs> Why am I constantly in all chat? I don't want that. Alright, let's just shut up again. Uh, Protoss finishing up his plus one plus one armor and Terran finishing up his plus two armor. And what we see, huge developments on the Terran side. We're going for the attack on the Protoss army. Prepare your storms. Prepare your storms, Lurts. No, what are you doing? What are you doing? No, 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 no. You're, you're, oh, there goes the Colossus one shot. Okay, I guess. Ooh, big, big, big. Ooh, ooh, big. <sighs> that was rather nice. Boofty leaving his fourth over there, focusing on his army mainly. That's a lot of lag. There goes. There goes the ground troops, but he still has his Vikings. His Vikings going down rather quickly, and that teaches you to not mess with Protoss because Protoss death ball is rather OP. Leaving the medevac up. Why is he leaving it up? Okay, well probably because he's going quickly to his base to counter attack him. But he does not know the siege tank is waiting for him. And the Vikings can actually kill the Colossus as well, but he does not have any Colossus anymore. Ooh, unpleasant surprise for him there. Where did his fourth go? Ah, his fourth is going there. Third spotted that. Lord, you're killing your zealots. No, just move them. Move them. You're killing your immortal. Oh my god, Lurts. You're, you need to pay attention to your army, man. Just like what I did not do. <laughs> Killed eight workers, that's not too bad, but hey. It did cost a lot of his stuff as well. Finishing up the plus two, plus two for the Protoss. Building war prisms. Yes, he has storm, he has storm. I know. But he does not use it because he's stupid. Building a planetary fortress. I, I would not shift that. Oh, thank you. There we go. That's a lot. <laughs> I mean, Terran units lost rather a lot of, well, simple light units, but Protoss did lose a lot of late game units. Cancelled the planetary, flying away with the command center, and trying to increase the income again with these mules. Both the has his army ready already. And let's see this next clash of titans. Of, of, or of titans now, of bronze heroes. We'll see. Oh, Lurch, you need to pay attention! Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. The tank is destroying the rocks. Warping in more High Templars and Zealots and Stalkers. He's just reinforcing his light armor. 
He discovered the pylon. Lurch. Lurch your thing. Lurch your thing. Oh my god. He's building his mothership. He's building his mothership, boys. Oh. Poggers. Poggers in chat, guys. And on the other hand, Bufti is just producing his light army. Oh shit, we missed the entire battle over here. Bufti and won this entire fight over here. And wow, we missed me fight. <laughs> I'm so good at casting, boys. Okay, Lurts for the 1 0 victory. The next match, best out of three. Will this guy win the match? We'll see. Uh, this can be the last match of today. We'll see. Seriously, I really do hope <laughs> by, uh, <laughs> that, that this uploads to Twitch later on. But that is not of the matter. We're playing on King's Cove as next match. As, as next map. Let's see. <laughs> King's Cove, as you can see over here. It's like a beach. Yeah, I'm ready. Uh, let's see. Ready. Have fun, have fun. This could be this deciding match for Lurts coming in third place. We'll see. <sighs> Kings Cove Alley. Looks rather nice. Not gonna lie. Marsara. Black screen. What's happening? Game. Okay, oh, well, that was just strange on my side. Buffy keeps changing colors. Eh? Oh, just a camouflage, I guess. I don't know. The gold versus the plat. MMR difference is not that big. Doesn't matter. Lord Speed, the plat. My game. Just trying. Okay, never mind. In the bottom right corner, we've got Mr. Lurts. If my game will actually respond. Yes, there we go. The blue Protoss. And in the top left corner, we've got the orange Terran, Mr. Boofty. Nice, nice, nice. What is he doing? Is he going. Uh, I suppose Boofty is going the proxy barracks. Proxy push. And on the other hand, Lurts is just building its normal build order. Uh, why can't I switch jet? Uh, okay. What is he doing? Yeah, he's building his proxy barracks. There we go. Just what I expected. Lurch has not spotted that yet. Let's see. Chrono boosting his Nexus, building a two gateways, and building a second gas. Going into the base, but no, he can't because it's blocked off. Haha. <laughs> Bufti almost finishing up his double barracks. Which Lurch is not spotted yet. Lurch building. 
Oh, excuse me. Uh, building his first zealot and also finish up his second gateway. F building his cybernetic score so he can research the warp gate as soon as possible. Building two more barracks. He's starting to build these things. Wait, does Buffy actually see this? No, he has not spotted it yet. And Bufti does not know what is going on there either. Building his first command center with, uh, with the set dish on it. I'm, I've got the name. This guy over here, Lurch, is already building his robotics facility with two adapts. Over here, there, yes. Only one. Still hasn't spotted the proxy. Is he gonna spot it now? No, move closer to here. Move closer, move closer. No, no, move closer. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, he spotted it. Oh no, you're so busted. Oh no. Busted. Boofy decides to make the first push. Meanwhile, Lurch only has three units available. Going for the supply block, going for the supply block. Yes, supply blocked. Rip. Building a bunker so he can probably set up defense later on. Ooh. One zealot dead is bigger than one marine dead. The losses for Lurch have been greater already. Is Lurch gonna lose this match? Is it gonna be a 1 1? Is it gonna be a deciding match next match? Probably. Or maybe not, because Lurch can actually still make up for this. Because he has a mortal outlet now, which is rather OP. But no. Bufti has to pull back from the god immortal with four kills. Meanwhile, building another immortal. Rebuilding his strong army. Not having his workers optimized yet. yet. No gas yet. This is not looking good for Bufti, if I may say so. Look at the losses. Yeah, Bufti has lost less in minerals than Lurch. But Lurch is getting up better. Bufti is rebuilding his army rather quickly. Just like Lurch is doing on his. Building the Stargate. Bufti is still not having any gas, which I would say is essential for Marauders. Bufti, what are you doing? Do something! Lurch really likes to and really wants to expand, but he can't because Bufti is being annoying for him. Still not doing anything in his main base. Looks like Lurch is gonna go for the mineral line, Harris. Also, finishing up the shield, baby! <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. He does not know. Yeah, he's probably drunk, but no. This does not look good for Lurch. Also, yeah, okay, no. This not this not not uh, this does not look good for Bufty. There we go. <laughs> but Bufty can recover from it rather quickly. No, not to start. No. Oh. Oh, this team, 10 HP. 10 HP. And Bufti just concedes. Lurch won the match. Lurch won bronze. The bronze medal. GG. Yep, GG. Congratulations. Thank you. Do you want to have a post-game interview? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, why not? Okay. If you have something to ask. Well, what was going through your mind when you almost lost... But the, mor but the uh, Immortal came out just in time. Uh, uh, hey Dave, you're just in time uh, for the end of the tournament. That was so lucky. Oh. Uh, well, that wasn't lucky. When I saw that he was building three depots so on top of his main, I immediately Wait, knew that something... Dave, uh, the Dave, Dave, shut up! We're having a post-game interview! Yeah, uh, he's interviewing me. Uh, 
so when I saw three demos, I knew that something was uh, really funky and that he was probably proxy Barrack doing proxy Rex or some shit. When I saw uh, within my shade Marines, I knew exactly what it was. Just mass proxy Marines. But yeah, Immortal did save me. Did you know that Boofy actually did not farm any gas there? He was just going proxy uh, barracks. I did not. Well, how could I anyway? Because he yeah. was off his main and I didn't have an observer. Would you say that that was his mistake of not getting gas? Because uh, I would say Marauders would have made the difference over there. Yeah, kinda, but uh, it's also longer to get, so uh, by the time he got his Marauders, I would already have a, a huge army to deal with those wrecks. Fair enough. Alright, well, thank you for this interview. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, that was the match. Um, I guess we'll just be shutting down, unless we can do a party or something. Is anyone in for some rain or party or something? Uh, I'm not in. I have to go. All right. Have a good one. Uh, you too. See ya. Bye. See, see ya. Uh, I'll be shutting down the stream so that uh, this uh, broadcast can upload to my Twitch. Ciao.